Alright guys, hello. Good afternoon everyone. This is a uh, well we're back Filipino Blue Family. Yeah. Part 2 of the cost of living here in, in the Philippines. Philippines. Um, we've been getting a lot of comments and emails about um, you know some of the things that we were wrong on um, as far as what the cost of food is here in the Philippines. Um, we actually have a receipt. We did go grocery shopping last uh, time. What? What is today? Thursday. So, oh, happy Valentine's, people. Um, yeah. <laughs> so maybe by the time I edit, it'll be a day late. But anyway, um, oh, and I do want to give a shout out to uh, a new subscriber, Van. Um, thank you for flagging us on one of the um, things that um, we could be wrong on in that sense. Um, but anyway which we'll jump to that um we got a, a reply on on it on this channel that um they um he's been here a little bit actually a lot longer than i have and he says that the eggs here are $1.44 for 12 dozen um usd well i'm sorry um before i guess he left a year and a half ago it was a dollar forty-four at H E B. H E B is a uh, grocery store in Texas, which I'm familiar with. I'm from Texas as well. Um, lived in Texas and then, of course, um, in Florida. But um, he said it was a dollar forty-four. Well, we just Googled it, and it's two dollars and eighty-nine cents. Um, here, we can go to an S M and get it for a little under um, one fifty pesos. So it's yeah. still maybe 20 to 40 cents cheaper. So in some sense, yes, there, there are some foods here that are uh, more expensive, but we do have a receipt and give me, give me a, a price. Yeah, I spent 3000 pesos and I still got more food, which if, even if you want around 3000 off, a uh, thousand is 20. This was so long. Yeah, so 1,020, um, 1,000, I'm sorry, 1,000 is 20, so 20, 40, 60 bucks. And sorry guys, but the amount of food that we bought, even though it's some of the food I don't like, but we'll eat and survive on, um, that's $60. I mean, the food that I bought, even if I went to Walmart, I mean, I, I just left in, in October of, of 2018. Um, it would have been 80 to to $100 easy. So, it's still a big difference. And I also did look up rent just before we came on here. Now, we do live in a hut. Um, we do live in one of the nicer cities um, in the Philippines, but it's more expensive. But since we still live in a hut, we pay $3,500 a month. Our water is, what? How much did we pay last night, last month? For the water? For the water. It was what, 300, 300 pesos. Yeah. 300 pesos, okay. Um, and the electricity was 800 pesos. So that's less than $10. You can't do that in America. So, sorry, it just, it's just, a lot cheaper here now um, we have another uh, friend of ours he's from Switzerland and he'll be I'll be actually helping him uh, create a vlog and I'm probably gonna blotch this he actually create, uh, created created broke a, a record uh, he actually he has a company there in Switzerland and um, he's like 41 years old but now he bicycles he 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 broke some kind of record as far as you know how much bicycling he did I'll get all that fixed and answered but he lives in a condo and he only pays and it's a big condo he only pays 20,000 pesos a month and, and that's in Tagaiti okay so um, which is what $400 a USD so it's still cheaper to live here 
Now, have I seen inflation hit? Yes. Is it weird? Yes. Diesel is cheaper than gasoline. It's vice versa in America. Um, so there's just still a big difference. So how much did we pay for a loaf of bread, babe? Uh, we bought two loaves of bread. She, she likes Let me it. see. It was 38 pesos for a loaf of bread, a full-size loaf of bread, if I remember right. Because I like to look for prices. It's 35 pesos each. 35 pesos each. Yeah. 35 pesos each. Guys, so. 52 pesos, and there again, depending on the rate exchange, um, just say 52, okay? That's been the average I've seen. It goes up. The 53, the highest I've ever seen it, but is a dollar. And before I left, I was almost 259, 289. I'm sorry, 259 to 289 for just a loaf of bread. The same kind of bread I can eat here. Um, so it's still cheaper. Um, we bought, which I don't like, we bought canned meats. Um, she likes the canned, how do you say canned can the Basit Canton. Whatever she just said. <laughs> so um, I am learning Tagalog, but anyway. Um, so even if you go to the dollar store, those little um, and I forget what they call them, but you can buy three in a pack. It's either three, three or four in a pack. They're little styrofoam cups of the the noodles. You can get shrimp, beef, or chicken. I know you know you guys know what I'm talking about. That's a dollar. Uh, we paid 68 pesos for the big bags, um, which is a little over a dollar, uh, but um, we get more in a, a what, six in a, a big pack, and they're actually pretty good. But um, then spaghetti, big bags of spaghetti with the sauce. Per kilo. Yeah, it's like it's over for, per, it, it over averages kilo. between 159 to. 109 pesos, which is still two dollars or something. But um, even when I left the states, um, just a just a decent um, size. Even if you're trying to uh, feed two, that was 89 cents of, of just the spaghetti. Then you had to buy the sauce. So it's you know, and there again, I just wanted to correct it. And this is like I said, part two of it. That there are some things here um, that are as expensive or more depending on how you want to buy there again so we actually have money in our savings account now than we ever had before so um, let's see what else is different um, sorry guys it's been yeah a long but, uh, day. Valentine's Day yes. one, one more round yeah. Uh, I'm sorry guys, my husband comparing, if he's comparing the amount from U.S. where he's living before mm -hmm. and here from, uh, versus here in Philippines where I, where we living my recent, uh, this, uh, my recent home, our recent home. Mm -hmm. So, but it's not same, same price into another no. place. No. So, in other words, it's much uh, easier to live here where we at now mm -hmm. than into others. It's too maybe it's a little bit higher. Yeah. Well, just like Manila, for example, yeah. it, the the rent's going to be higher there. Yeah. Um, so it it there again, it depends on where you're going to live. Yes. Um, of how much you know when you want to compare U.S. to yeah. um, the Philippines, but. There again, why are so many expats coming to the Philippines? They're, well, besides trying to get out, get the hell out of the United States, um, you know, now our taxes, I just saw some news about um, um, now people are owing taxes because they don't get the same tax deductions that they did before. So um, I don't know, man. Just thank God I'm out of the U.S. and I love the Philippines and. and it's just so much easier to live here. It, so that's the bottom oh, line. Oh, you're enjoying on how to go in supermarket and pick all of those uh, stuff. Mm -hmm. I'm still learning. But yeah. like I said, I'm... More uh, cheaper. Just, guys, just the MSG thing here, though, that's real when you see that. I really day. love where, uh, where we at. And 
we're happy here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Especially yeah. all of those uh, uh, items that we bought in supermarkets. It's not much e expensive, more cheaper. But I I really don't know in the other place. Uh, it, she hasn't uh, been there. Yeah. How are you guys? Oh yeah, well I just showed you online the the rent prices. Yeah, in the United too much States. expensive. It, it's it's. Um, we search uh, different kinds of uh, rent house and he he showed me the her uh, his former home home and it was oh my god so expensive. Uh, well. Yeah, that's when I was rich, but um, before the divorce. But um, yeah, I just um, you know that was uh, a fourth, uh, almost a three thousand square foot home, a little over three thousand square foot, almost five acres of land. Um, I only paid fifteen hundred dollars a month for that, um, and that was right before the crash, I believe, something like that um, in two thousand eight. But um, I had it, kept it you know all those years up until 2015 but um just um regards of that um really even when you look at what's happening in the united states um I, you can google this again guys but i think it's it's like over half or close to half of the u.s um, whether you want to consider it an individual or a married, as in other words, individual is maybe making thirty thousand a year, um, and then you know, husband and wife maybe sixty thousand. Of course, we're just talking average American. We're not talking the doctors, and you know, so it, it's it's um, paycheck to paycheck. And the reason I was trying to make that first video on the cost of living here is, is if you're going to live paycheck to paycheck I'd rather be here in the Philippines than I would in America. Um, try getting in a taxi in America and giving them 10 pesos which even if you said 10 cents and go five miles okay or we had to go to immigration the other day it cost us 66 pesos uh, that's a little over a dollar it was a 40, for the travel. Yeah, it was like 45 minutes both ways. So 66, I'm sorry, 66 pesos for both of us. If it would have been me, it would have been 33 pesos. But we went together, so you know you can do the math and come back. Try doing that in America. You can't do it. Um, we're we're wanting to buy a bike, and we did go to one place, and it's um, paying 400 dollars a month, not U.S. pesos. So that's 400. Uh, what is that? Um, less than ten bucks a month. Now it's a little too little of a bike for me. Um, you know, these are Philippine bikes. You know, we need the big bikes. We're big people, but it's still it just it's just cheaper. So um, I appreciate your comments and tell me where you want me to to come back with on a comment um, because Van you are right uh, yeah, in, yeah, in, in some of the sense um, but um, you know you've been gone for a year um, Google it the stuff is getting more expensive inflation happens here too in, in the Philippines but it's more rampant um, in the US right now than it is anywhere else of course what happens in the US trickles down I get all that but anyway all those uh, uh, I saw some comments in our videos and thank you for the comments uh, yes thank you uh, one more things guys it's not same same the price that we're going to live just like here in us uh, we're just only live on how we how we live now yeah, on how we live now yeah. but uh in in i don't know the the other place it's to higher uh, prices when it comes to the grocery but uh yeah just like in yeah. the united states guys i mean california's prices are going to be higher than texas or you know it's the same thing it's just going to depend on where you live but yes. um you know when it comes to the philippines you know rent will be higher rent will be less but um even if we went to manila your job offer I think it was almost uh, double the pay yeah. 
Um, so living conditions um, we could be in a bigger place. Um, the rent would be a little bit higher, but we'd still be the same. <laughs> but it uh, depends in uh, on how you can live in there. Uh, yeah. The prices, especially the rent house. So. Uh, and I think I mentioned this in the other video. Yeah, if you're coming from the states and you're thinking you're going to live, I mean, yeah, if you got the income, fine. But if you don't, I mean, I'm not retired yet, so my stuff is I'm working online and doing stuff. Um, and I still have a little bit of money coming from the states, but it's not retirement states. It's just checks that are owed to me. Um, will eventually fade out, but um, we still, I still live better here. I guess is really the bottom line. I, you know, so um, anyway, guys, we'll leave it at that. I hope that cleared up a little bit more. Um, you know, we are still trying to learn how to make good content and yeah, better guys. videos. We're new. Both of us are new at this. So, but we definitely appreciate the subscribers that we have, the comments that you make. Thank you for to all subscriber and who those uh, uh, put a comments in our videos. Thank you so much. Thank you. And for being with us. And hey, watch out our uh, next videos uploaded here in. Filipina Blue family, thank you so much and God bless. Yeah, hit the notification bell. We yeah. got some stuff, <laughs> some fu some funny stuff coming. Um, but anyway, so anyway, God bless America. God bless the Philippines. Philippines and happy, happy, happy Valentine's Day yeah. to all those who uh, have a uh, feb, feb a big John guys. <laughs> yeah. Enjoy, right. enjoy your night. Cheers. Bye.